What's up, folks? It's your boy, Mr. Bank Anchor, back again with another update. Um, Post-surgery, today marks four months out of surgery for me, four months recovery. Um, this video I'm making today, another short video, um, this is just going to basically cover how I felt when I got my collar, my neck brace took off or didn't have to wear it anymore. Um, and uh, I'm going to make two more videos, I guess you can say fairly in the near future, because um, I go. I believe I'm going to go back to work pretty soon. I haven't been to work yet in four months, so I'm going to go back to work pretty soon, so I'll let you know how I feel once I get back to work. I do have a pretty, I guess, body straining type of job, so I'll, I'll update you guys on that and how I feel, and I'll talk more about, you know, working and stuff like that. And then I'm going to do another video kind of just going over the whole experience from when I felt pain, you know, everything leading up to surgery and after surgery pretty much. But today I'm just going to limit this to how I felt when I got my collar taken off. So I had my surgery April 23rd. Today is August 23rd. Like I said, that marks four months. I went to the doctor June 22nd, which would have been two months after surgery. And that's when they told me I didn't have to wear my collar anymore. Um, now, I felt fine wearing my collar, didn't have any issues, none of that. But the same day I took that I didn't have to wear my collar anymore, I actually went, like, walking around the mall, things like that, and just trying, you know, looking at shoes and clothes and stuff like that. And I got to tell you, it, it hurt. Like, it, it's not like an internal hurt. It's just like the muscles. Muscles were just hurting, like, I mean, just hurt. I can't describe it besides just saying they hurt. Um, it felt like I was just working out too much or like if you haven't worked out in a long time like and you just decide to go hard with the weights one day that kind of pain you would feel like muscle aches that's how I felt out of my collar the first day um, I would honestly say that pain probably lasted a good like continuous if continuous pain that probably lasted I said about two weeks honestly like just hurting you know I didn't have to take any pain meds it wasn't as bad make me want to call a doctor or rush to the hospital or anything like that it just was you know an aching pain that lasted about two weeks and after that i mean it kind of balanced itself out i do have flare up and when i do have pain it's it's just the neck area that's it like it's just just like in right in the back top of the shoulders it's just like a muscly type pain not like a not like that pinched nerve pain which i you hear you guys hear me stress that a lot um i don't think nothing can, can compare to that pain but I've never been pregnant either, so that's that. But um, like I said, I, I felt just a lot of pain that first day out. It, I mean, it was like, like, oh, did I move it too much? Or, you know, it just was real awkward feeling. But I guess I feel fine now. I mean, I do have my moments. Like the other day I was walking in Walmart. I mean, I felt good at the house. I felt good mowing the grass. I felt good, you know, doing different things around the house. But it's just like I walked in Walmart and just I just felt just – a lot of pain up in the same area. The same area is like back up in here, like the trapezius muscle, I think it's called. Just a lot of pain right there, and like seeing like the neck muscles, you know, same thing. Um, I do still, I know you've seen my other videos where I say my finger gets numb. It still does when I sit down like this, if you don't know I'm sitting, but it does still get numb when I sit for long periods of time. And sometimes, like I drove four hours, which is the longest I've sat in a car driving. Um, and I felt just like a aching pain, I guess, I don't know, just the tricep or what, but it just felt sore for some reason. I mean, not like, again, not nothing to make me say, oh, I need to go to the doctor, call my surgeon, see what's going on, you know, but I, I did feel a little pain right there. And I still get that from time to time, the finger numb from time to time. But like my surgeon explained to me, those nerves take a while to heal. I mean, if you guys do your research, you'll see a lot of people say they take up, sometimes can take up to a year. And, and the nerves that I had issues with, they control, you know, that tricep muscle and numbness in the finger. So I'm just going to stick and run with that. Like I said, I'm not too nervous about it, not bugged out about it. I just want to be honest with you guys. Because like I said, I make these videos because I know how scared I was leading up to surgery. And I had just a million and one questions. And I never gonna, I'm never going to get all the answers, and I'm not going to have all the answers. So, I mean, it's, I can only tell you from my experience. So, like I said, this is more or less about when I got my neck brace taken off. And like I said, I was in pain for about two months. I mean, two weeks, but I'm, I'm two months out of that. So, this is like 
what, eight, six weeks pain-free. Well, not pain-free, but just not constant pain. I mean, sometimes I still be like, oh, man, oh, man, just feeling like I need to roll my neck around. And another thing I had um, I want to address, um, I was getting a, a lot of comments late. Well, not a lot, but I've been getting some action on my on some of my videos, and people have comments to make. And um, most people ask me, like, how is my range of motion on my neck? So I just want to do that for you guys before I go. And I'm, I'm going to address one more issue too. But just one, the, the range of motion, I have. I don't think I have any issues looking up, looking down, no restrictions or anything like that. Now, when I do that, I just feel tightness back here in these trapezius muscles again, like I said. Um, look left, look right, no issue. Roll my neck around, right? No issue. No issue. Don't. I mean, only thing I like. I said I feel those trapezius muscles just feel sore. The only restriction I do notice is if I try to ear to shoulder like this. And see, I think I can go. This is my me leaning to my right. I think I can go more to the right than I can to the left. Like I feel a lot restriction when I try to do left. But that just. I saw one lady's uh, one video where a woman said, you know. Her job, she had to talk on the phone and type, and she would like to have the phone like this. She said after she had the surgery, she pretty much couldn't do that. And I can't, well, I mean, I've got a cell phone, so it's almost impossible to do that anyway. But, like, I, I've, that's not going to happen. Like, I can't put my phone like this and, and talk. It's not. It's just not going to happen. But that's not a big deal to me. I mean, I didn't talk like that anyway, so, I mean, I never try to put my ear to my shoulder anyway. So, that's not a big deal to me. And if you guys can see, this is my incision. Um, I think it's healing pretty well. Now, they told me I would have an incision, but they didn't tell me I would have this. This is where the little tube was stuck in my throat. I don't really care for that being there, but it's there. I'm fine with it, and that's what it is. Um, and I'm going to go over some more marks. If, just in case this fades away, that mark right there, and I got one on my foot. I don't know if they did something that had something plugged to me or strapped to me during surgery, but I had two marks on my body that weren't there before. Um uh, I don't know what it is, but I don't know. It don't bother me, really. But um, like I said, this was just more about when I got my neck collar taken off. Like I said, I was in my collar for two two months, eight weeks. Um, some people say they don't even have to wear a collar. You know, hey, good for you. I did for two months. I mean, it didn't bother me. I was comfortable in my collar, and I felt good in my collar. But that first day I took it off, like I said, I didn't just take it off and go lay down. I took it off and went walking in the mall and went grocery shopping and all kind of stuff. And, I mean, I could feel it. Like, it just felt like I was – it felt like my head was too heavy for my neck, and my neck was just sore from that. But, um, like I said, other than that, I feel fine. Um, and just please, just leave – if you're going to comment, just please keep it respectful. You know, some things might hurt people's feelings or scare other people, so keep that in mind. You know, I don't mind you commenting on here with your experience. That's fine. But don't wish – don't wish me any uh, no bad will. Don't don't wish me bad health or pain in the future. I don't don't do that, please. Just keep it respectful. You know, keep the comments coming so other people can read them and make their own you know judgment if they have surgery coming up or looking to get surgery or thinking about getting surgery. Um, like I said, that pretty much covers it. I just wanted to talk about the collar mostly, getting it off, and the pain I felt with it. Um, lasted about two weeks, but like I said, I feel fine. Like It wasn't enough pain to make me want to call the doctor or call the surgeon and say, hey, something's wrong, or go get x-rays or this and that. Um, and the day I did get my collar taken off, I did get x-rays done, and they said everything looks good, everything's improving, you know. So that's a good thumbs up. I go to the doctor again tomorrow, but like I said, I just got a feeling they're just going to release me to go back to work, and that's pretty much it. So once I get back to work and see how that my body feels, I would, you know, kind of give you a description of what I do for work and how I feel. And then, like I said, the video after that, I'm going to do, that'll probably be my longest video. This one already running 10 minutes, which I didn't want to do, but um, that'll probably be my longest running video, and I'm just going to cover everything, all aspects of everything, how I felt, how I feel, what's going on with me. Don't know when I'm going to do it, but I, I will get to it. And like I said, feel free to comment, because the main reason I'm making these videos is because I was scared terrified out of my mind leading up to surgery and I just try to give people a, a peace and ease of mind you know not to go crazy leading up to this so we're bearing down on 10 minute mark and that's pretty much all I want to say guys any questions feel free to ask um in the comments and I'll do my best to get back to you I think I've been answering pretty much everybody comments that I can understand and forgive me if you speak another language and you don't type 
in common English. I, I I'm sorry if I don't understand you. I try, um, and I try to do the best I can. But just um, just know if you have any questions, feel free to ask. And we out.